Do you think you're a self-actualized person? Or do you just want to know what being self-actualized is? Then you're at the right place. Today at Wise Minds, we're going to go over 8 characteristics of self-actualized people. Make sure to watch until the end of the video to find out our top characteristic of a self-actualized person. Let's start by knowing what self-actualization is. It's considered to be the last stage of development in the hierarchy of needs created by psychologist Abraham Maslow. His hierarchy of needs describes all the common needs that humans have. The hierarchy is sometimes represented as a pyramid, with the lowest tiers of the pyramid reflecting simple needs like safety and security or love or belonging needs. The tiers on top represent more complicated needs like self-esteem and self-actualization. Self-actualization occurs at the top of this pyramid. The hierarchy implies that you should center your efforts on this highest need for the self-actualization when all the other basic requirements at the base of the pyramid have been fulfilled. This stage of self-actualization is reached when a person can take maximum advantage of his or her abilities while also being conscious of their weaknesses. Self-actualization is often used to talk about an intellectual maturity marked by the fulfillment of ambitions, self-acceptance, and the capacity to critically and objectively judge oneself. Now that we know what self-actualization is and what it is to have peak experiences, let's take a look at the eight characteristics of self-actualized people. Number eight, people who are self-actualized have peak experiences. Maslow says that you have a lot of peak experiences when you are self-actualized. He defines having peak experiences as feelings of limitless horizons opening up to the vision, the feeling of being simultaneously more powerful and also more helpless than one ever was before, the feeling of ecstasy, wonder and awe, the loss of placement in time and space with finally the conviction that something extremely important and valuable has happened. These strong psychophysiological responses also include pleasure, curiosity, awe, and happiness, and are believed to be more frequent among self-actualized individuals. It is thought that these peak encounters create simulating emotions such as motivation, physical, and mental energy, and a refreshed sense of perspective. Number seven, they possess a democratic view and have self-acceptance. Those who are self-actualized embrace themselves and people as they are. They seem to not have inhibition and will appreciate themselves and their guilt-free lives. Not only can self-realized individuals recognize themselves completely, they even support others for who they are. All people are viewed the same despite age, social position, or other social economic and cultural variables. There's a huge gap between our inner selves and the real universe. We have a distorted perception of ourselves or the outside world. Those that hold the most realistic understanding of themselves and the environment surrounding them are the ones that achieve self-actualization. Number six, they have a good sense of realism. Another significant aspect of self-actualized people is their sense of reality. Self-actualization represents the individual's recognition of who they are, what they're capable of, and their reasonable and detailed understanding of the environment surrounding them, including the individuals inside it and how they relate to each other. Those that hold the most realistic understanding of themselves and the environment surrounding them gain self-actualization. Rather than being scared of new or uncertain things, the self-actualized personality perceives life as it progresses both objectively and rationally. Number 5. They are problem-centered. Individuals that are self-actualized are also guided by a deep sense of ethical integrity and commitment. 
They love adapting their problem solving abilities to issues in the modern world, and they want to help others better their own lives. Individuals that are self actualized are not solely centered on personal gain. They understand the advantages of addressing challenges that impact others and better the environment. The motivation to support others is derived from an intrinsic sense of right and wrong and is focused on empathy. Number four, they are autonomous. People that are self actualized seem to be very autonomous. They do not live up to the ideals of pleasure or contentment of other individuals. This initial viewpoint helps the person to live in the moment and enjoy each of their experiences. Number three, they enjoy solitude. Individuals who are self actualized respect their anonymity and appreciate isolation. While they still enjoy others' company, Finding time for themselves is essential to their personal development and to nurture their individual ability. Whereas the self actualized adhere to social expectations and are always people centered in problem solving, the desire for personal rights and privacy is also important. These private moments are spent assessing their abilities, both physiologically, for example, worrying about their issues. But also physically, which includes working out to determine strengths and weaknesses. Number two, they possess a philosophical sense of humor. Another distinctive trait of self actualizing individuals is their philosophical sense of humor. Much of what occurs with satire or entertainment is fundamentally violent, pornographic, Or scatological. The chuckle is typically at the detriment of someone else. Good people find a little irony in put down jokes. They can have fun laughing at themselves, but maybe not so often. They make less attempts at comedy than most, but their attempts have a function that goes beyond having people laugh. They try to entertain, remind, and evoke smiles. Individuals who are self actualized. Usually have a considerate sense of humor. They can love the humor of scenarios and chuckle at themselves. But at the expense of another person's emotions, they do not really mock or taunt. If you've come this far, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. A lot of hard work goes into making these videos, so all the love and support is appreciated. And now, without further ado, Get ready to find out about our top pick for the characteristic of a self actualized person. Let's get into it. Number one, they are spontaneous. The trait that we think characterizes self actualized people the most is that they are spontaneous. They have a propensity to be unpredictable, unorthodox, and free. While these individuals may obey commonly agreed social rules, in their thoughts or attitudes, they do not feel constrained by these standards. As a consequence of possessing a clear understanding of themselves and the universe, the self actualized personality thinks and behaves naturally. Despite this spontaneity, these people prefer to behave and react according to other people's standards. And within agreed social norms. These people are often transparent in their relationships with others, but unusual in their modes of language, expression, and other behavioral aspects. Another characteristic of self actualized people is that they enjoy the ride, not just the destination. Although people who are self actualized have clear ambitions, They do not see things purely as a means to an end. The path toward an objective is just as critical and satisfying as the eventual accomplishment of the goal. These were the eight characteristics of self actualized people. Hopefully, you found this video useful and you've learned something new. 
subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss any future videos we upload. I'll see you all in the next video. Stay wise.